tan of pi by 8 equals to how much? How to find out the value of tan of pi by 8? And this video is meant for 11th class students who are learning about double angles and half angles for the first time. Now we have to find out the value of tan of pi by 8. Now the angle is pi by 8. For which angle nearest to pi by 8? We know all the trigonometric ratios pi by 4. So let us say pi by x equals to pi by 8. Then what will be pi by 4? It is, which is nothing but 2x equals to pi by 4. So we know trigonometric ratios of angle pi by 4 sine of pi by 4, cos of pi by 4, tan of pi by 4, all of them we know. Now we want to find out tan of pi by 8. So how can we leverage the trigonometric ratios of pi by 4 to get the value of tan of pi by 8? For that, we'll step a little bit back and try to understand how to find out our tan of pi by 8, which is tan of x. Now tan of x I want to find out, but I want to leverage tan of 2x. So can I write down tan 2x in terms of x? If I am able to write tan 2x in terms of x, then I will get a quadratic equation. I will solve it. I will get my answer. So for that, we will use the formula that tan 2x equals to 2 tan x divided by 1 minus tan square x. tan 2x is tan of pi by 4 and we know tan of pi by 4 equals to 1. So can we write down 1 equals to 2 tan x divided by 1 minus tan square x or let's get that into quadratic equation form. We will have tan square x plus 2 tan x minus 1 equals to 0. Let us use quadratic formula. We will have tan x equals to minus b minus 2 plus or minus b square minus 4ac. b square is 4 minus 4ac minus of minus 1 is 1. 1 into 4 is 4 divided by 2 which is equals to minus 2 plus or minus root 8 which can be written as 2 root 2 divided by 2 and that is equals to minus 1 plus or minus root 2. So we have two options either it is minus 1 minus root 2 or minus 1 plus root 2. Now we know that all trigonometric ratios are positive in first quadrant pi by 8 is an angle between 0 to pi by 2. That means all trigonometric ratio should be positive. So this value is not considered. Our answer is root 2 minus 1. So tan pi by 8 is equ equals to root 2 minus 1. So let's write it down. Tan pi by 8 equals to root 2 minus 1. Now that is one way how we can solve it. We will see other way of solving it also. So let's go to the next method. In the second method we will write down tan of x equals to sin x divided by cos x. Now we want to write down this sin x and cos x in terms of angle 2x. For that we will leverage the formula that cos 2x equals to 1 minus 2 sin square x. Also cos 2x is equal to 2 cos square x minus 1. Now from the first one we will get sin square x 2 sin square x equals to 1 minus cos 2x or can we say that sin x equals to square root of 1 minus cos 2x divided by 2. Similarly, 
here we will have 2 cos square x equals to 1 plus cos 2x that will give us cos x equals to square root of 1 plus cos 2x divided by 2. Now sin x is square root of 1 minus cos x divided cos 2x divided by 2 and cos x is square root of 1 plus cos 2x divided by 2. So let's write them here and we can see that 2 and 2 will cancel. So our next step will be that is equals to square root of 1 minus cos 2x divided by 1 plus cos 2x. Let us substitute the values of cos 2x. What is our cos 2x here? Cos 2x is cos of 2x is cos of pi by 4. Cos of pi by 4 is 1 by root 2. So it will become square root of 1 minus 1 by root 2 divided by 1 plus 1 by root 2. On simplification, this is equals to square root of 2 minus 1 divided by square root of 2 plus 1 under root. Now, we will try to rationalize it. Multiply with root 2 minus 1 by root 2 minus 1. So, we will get our answer as square root of root 2 minus 1 whole square divided by root 2 whole square minus 1 square and that is equals to square root of root 2 minus 1 whole square divided by 1 which is equals to root 2 minus 1. So tan of pi by 8 equals to root 2 minus 1 that is the other way how we can find it out. So let us have a recap of this what we need to find out is tan of pi by 8. One method tan pi by 8, let us say x equals to pi by 8, then we want to find out tan x in terms of tan 2x. For that we have a formula tan 2x equals to 2 tan x by 1 minus tan square x. That is one method we can do. The other method is we can write down sin x as root of 1 minus cos 2x by 2 and cos x as square root of 1 plus cos 2x by 2. So tan x is sin x by cos x square root of 1 minus cos 2x by 1 plus cos 2x. Substituting cos 2x equals to 1 by root 2, we can easily find out that tan x equals to square root of 2 minus 1. So the idea is we do not know what are the values of trigonometric ratios of this angle pi by 8, but we know it is multiple angle pi by 8 multiple x 2x pi by 4. And we know all the trigonometric ratio values of pi by 4. We know sin pi by 4, cos pi by 4, tan pi by 4. So we want to write down tan x in terms of tan 2x or in terms of cos 2x so that we can find out the value of tan pi by 8.